Hey everybody, I'm back. Been gone a few days. We were at a horse show. I think I explained that. Um, this is just going to be a drugstore haul. So let me just jump right in and tell you what I got. I went to Walmart because I had been searching for these pure clay masks by L'Oreal. This one's a detox and brightening. It's the, um, the three pure clays plus charcoal. They have three different varieties. It's the charcoal one and then the eucalyptus. And there's one more. I think it's like a red clay. Anyway, I just got these two. I think the other one, for some reason, I didn't. The other one didn't appeal to me. But I've heard lots of great things about these um, new L'Oreal mask. And for ten dollars, it's a pretty good size jar. What is it? 1.7 ounces. Let me open it. I haven't used them yet, so I can't tell you anything about them. So strictly just, just got it. Oh, there's a little. Doesn't smell bad. I don't know. You know, I'll let you know. I like a mask. I prefer a sheet mask. Y'all know that. But every so often, these are good to do to your, on your skin as well. Change it up a bit. So, um, again, I got the, what are they called? Pure clay mask, the charcoal, and the eucalyptus. They look like that in the box. Can you see? And then here's kind of the charcoal one out of the box. Ten dollars at Walmart. I had looked at other places and I hadn't seen them yet. So you know, maybe you'll have better luck. I don't know. Um, I shared this on Snapchat. The can you say? Ooh, wrong way. The L'Oreal Revital Lift Bright Reveal Brightening Peel Pads. Whew, that's a mouthful. They have ten percent glycolic acid, and that's immediately what appealed to me because I was like, ooh, that's some good stuff. So um, I've only used like three. I will report back after I go through the whole kind of container. There's 30 of them in here. It's just a real super plasticky, cheap, whatever. Who cares, you know? With 30 pre-moistened. Oh, I hate that word. Moist. I don't know what it is. Like, it's one of those words that just... Pre-saturated pads for your face. 30 of them in here. Okay. I'll let you know how that works out, too. Uh, so far, I like how they feel and smell. Both of those are good things. You know, I'm sensitive to smell. If it smells too florally or chemical, I'm tapping out. But those, the mask nor those pill pads do not. Um, oh, I also picked up these, this brand, Yes To. Oh, wrong way. Um, these are the detoxifying charcoal facial, facial wipes. Now, I've only used it once just to kind of see again if I like the scent and everything. And, um, but they're actually black in there. See? You know, hey, when I use them all, I'll let you know. And then the other Yes To product I got was the Primrose Oil. It's supposed to calm and soothe. Um, I, I like the smell of these. Both of these are from Walmart as well. I like the smell. And this one, my the one time I used it, it felt really nice and almost slightly moisturizing after. It's They're not, they don't claim to be, this one says moisturizing, facial wipe. They don't claim to be makeup removing wipes. These are for something totally different. This one says moisturizing, and this one says detoxifying and deep clean. So I haven't tried them to take makeup off. I don't think I will, but I will kind of once my makeup's off, wipe with them and tell you what I think. So that's those. Um, I picked this one up right here. Okay, oop, backwards. At Walgreens. And it's a vitamin C serum by that brand. Is it Lumiere? Lumiere? That brand? <laughs> anyway, it's a Bright Now Vitamin C Dry Skin Cocktail. The minute I saw Dry Skin Cocktail, I'm like, ding, I'm in. You're, you shake it up. So, tells me there's probably some oil in it. <laughs> uh, shake it up. Doop, 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 doop. I've used it a couple times. Again, I'll let you know more when I get through most of these things or all of these things. Uh, once I finished at Walgreens, the next set of products are all from TJ Maxx. Y'all know that I love sheet masks, and I go to TJ Maxx or Marshalls, in this particular case, it's TJ Maxx, to find sheet masks, specifically by this brand. Right here. Right here. By that brand. They make them in every type of scent, um need necessary like these say that they well these are infused with coconut oil which i always love ultimate moisturizers replenishes dry skin and leaves your skin dewy and supple but they also have a rose water 
which I do love. That one's really hard to find. It's kind of got um, a white box with little pink flowers on it. The aloe, I love the aloe one. They have a collagen. They have all different kinds. No matter what your skin type is or what your particular need in a skin mask, you will find it from this brand. And I enjoy them. And I know they sell them at Walgreens also, but at TJ Maxx, you can get the box of five. Whoops, right here. The box of five for $4.99. So a dollar a piece. I think it, um, oh, I'm getting out of focus there. Sorry guys. There we go. Um, and I think they're almost $2 at Walgreens. So when I see these there at TJ Maxx, I pick up any of the ones I can find. The other thing I got, which I've never tried, but it looked interesting to me were these foot suckies. Odd name, but there's two pairs in here. It's not like baby foot. This is strictly just a moisturizing foot mask, just like you would put like on your face, but these are for your feet just to keep, give it moisture. There's two pairs. It's a spearmint and tea tree oil. It says, it says right there in the box, you will love them. Well, two pairs for $4, so $2 a piece. I am going to um, try these out before our cruise and probably take a pair with me on the cruise. We'll see. Um, the other thing I picked up is this 100% natural coconut oil. Again, from TJ Maxx. I think it was like $7. It was $6.99. Um, I, I love oils on my skin. I'm super dry. I've told you all that. So I just feel like they, oh, I just soak in. And I love them. I know if a lot of people don't. If you're not an oil person, I get it. But this appealed to me. It said it's um, nutrient rich. And it rehydrates dry skin, has anti-aging properties. It's 100% natural. It was $7. Why not try it? So I did. I picked that up too. Like I said, TJ Maxx. Whoops, wrong way. Everything's so backwards here. So that's what that looks like there. And it was just on the shelf, kind of in the, I'm going to use this term lightly, beauty department of TJ Maxx. You know, whatever you want to call that little like aisle of hot mess express. I mean, there's just everywhere when you go over there. So yeah, if digging through things is not your thing, then skip the TJ Maxx beauty aisle. But I, I don't mind it. The other thing I found when I was at TJ Maxx that I'm kind of excited about, I need to get this in my shower, it's the Body Shop Honey, Ma Honey Mania sorry, shower gel. Now look, y'all, this thing is like as big as my head. Well, I mean, it's, it's a little smaller. But it was $8. It's ginormous. It was on clearance causes me this much concern you know always when things are on clearance like stuff like this I'm like mm, is it funky is there something janky about it nobody told me because oh, yeah, well. there was like two others so I'm like oh, please don't be icky so I did you know open it <laughs> smells delicious I love honey anything I love honey food like in my food I love honey like lotions the scent in this smells mm, yay mm. So anyway, it was $8. I'm going to try it. Hopefully it's not weird. So far, this smells great. It's just a, a shower gel, so I won't be putting that on my face. I also picked up, sorry, this is out of order. This was from uh, from the Walmart body scrub gloves. You just put them on, put like that shower gel on or a little exfoliator, and then it exfoliates your whole body while you're in the shower real quick, then hang them up to dry. I, I like these a lot. It makes It gets the job done fast. You can do both your legs. You know, you can just kind of go up and down the front and the back of your legs while you have them on, your arms. And again, exfoliation is done. And I think they're like five bucks for two. Yeah. Um, so I showed you all that. That two other little, oh, this is not exciting. I, um, am I the only person who, I lose these like crazy. Like, I, I can keep up with socks. I can't keep up with contact cases. I don't know. Got another pair of those. Uh, and I did pick up the Pixie Glow Tonic. I hear so many good things about this. And I have to say, for $15, $15 drugstore, this better be like smoking awesome. I need, I want my skin to feel like lit from within. It says right on there, glow. We will see. It does smell nice and it has 5% glycolic acid. Um, which again, always appeals to me. Glycolic acid's nice to resurface and, you know, help the mature woman's skin. So, uh, yeah, not, not an offensive smell at all. I really only used it once. So I'll let y'all know more when I get back to that and get through all of these things. I'm going to 
like I said, give them at least a month or longer, maybe six weeks, and uh, I'll come back and tell you what I think. So you can find me on Instagram, my blog, Instagram, my blog, and here on YouTube, it's all the same, totally Tika. On Snapchat, it's Tika C. Thanks for watching.